you haven't looked, if you haven't accepted the Lord Jesus Christ, do it today, guys. We're running out of time. I love you all so very much. I'll see you in the next video. Good night. All right, now I'm going to read Psalms chapter 50 from the 1537 Matthew's Holy Bible. You're welcome to follow along in whatever translation you're using. The title of this chapter here says, He prophesied that God will call all nations of the earth unto him by the gospel, and that he will require the confession and praising of his name, and not sacrifice, and how greatly he will abhor them, which boast themselves to be religious and holy, and are indeed nothing less. A Psalm of Asaph. The Lord, even the mighty God, hath spoken, and called the world from the rising up of the sun unto the going down of the same. Out of Sion appeareth the glorious beauty of God. Our God shall come, and not keep silence. There goeth before him a consuming fire, and a mighty tempest round about him. He shall call the heavens from above, and the earth, that he may judge his people. Gather my saints together unto me, those that set more by the covenant than by any offering. And the heavens shall declare his righteousness, for God is judge himself, Selah. Hear, O my people, let me speak, let me testify among you, O Israel. I am God, even thy God. I reprove thee not because of thy sacrifice. Thy burnt offerings are all way before me. I will take no bullocks out of thy house, nor goats out of thy folds. For all the beasts of the field are mine, and thousands of cattle upon the hills. I know all the fowls upon the mountains, and the wild beasts of the field are in, are in my sight. If I be hungry, I will not tell thee, for the whole world is mine, and all that therein is. Thinkest thou that I will eat the flesh of oxen, or drink the blood of goats? Offer unto God praise and thanksgiving, and pay thy vows unto the Most Highest. And call upon me in the time of trouble, so will I hear thee that thou shalt thank me. But unto the ungodly saith God, Why doest thou preach my laws, and takest my counsel in thy mouth? Whereas thou hatest to be reformed, and castest my words behind thee, if thou seest a thief, thou runnest with him, and art partaker with the adulterers. Thou lettest thy mouth speak wickedness, and thy tongue painteth deceit. Thou sittest and speakest against thy brother, yea, and sclanderest thine own mother's son. This thou doest, while I hold my tongue, and thinkest me to be even such one as thyself. But I will reprove thee, and set myself against thee. O oh, consider this, ye that forget God, lest I pluck you away, and there be none to deliver you. Whoso offereth me thanks and praise, he honoreth me. And this is the way, whereby I will show him the saving health of God. Psalms chapter 50 from the 1537 Matthew's Holy Bible.